avoiding Vitakim K for newborns. But actually, when people ask me, we're very openly say, here are the risks, here are the benefits, here's the number needed to treat and so on. Um, but, but for the people to think that vitamin K for a baby is bad, because that somehow came out of the woodwork as well. Yeah, you genuinely have no clue what you're talking about. Vitamin K is given to newborns because some newborns, clearly not all, but some newborns are vitamin K deficient. And vitamin K deficiency at birth is associated with a 700% increase in the baby's risk of having a stroke, people. So taking a shot of vitamin K, regardless of whether it's natural vitamin K or synthetic vitamin K, which is almost identical, has absolutely no impact on the baby, negative impact. I've never seen a negative outcome from it. And can save the baby's life, or at least save the baby from massive neurological trauma from having a newborn stroke. And while people are saying babies don't need it, they make their own, they don't make their own initially. It takes days, and in that interval, the baby can have a stroke. So before you're pontificating about all this vitamin K stuff on the black box morning, which is for way higher doses in adults and has nothing to do with giving it to babies, please stop spreading misinformation, especially on my channel, because I won't allow people to spread misinformation. Please, please, please actually think about what you're saying. And if you don't have a medical degree and you have an opinion, say, in my opinion, don't tell people they shouldn't be taking vitamin K and that everyone should look at the black box warning. The black box warning has nothing to do with treatment of children. Nothing. Zero. There are virtually no hypersensitivity reactions or cataclysmic collapses in babies who take vitamin K. But there are cataclysmic outcomes if you don't. So please think about that before you say or do.